Hey everybody, this is Carmen Electra, and you're watching Front Row Live Entertainment. Hey guys, Rob here with Front Row Live Entertainment. I'm hanging out today with Carmen Electra. How are you today? I'm good, really good. How are you? Doing great. It's it's good to sit down and speak with you. And this is the first time since 92 that you're working on music again? Yeah, it's kind of crazy. Um, I started off with an album that Prince produced, and, you know, it was just such a wonderful experience and really inspired me to move forward and uh, when I when I moved to LA um, so many other opportunities came my way and I was able to do so many different things which I'm I feel very lucky to do acting hosting um, all of that stuff but deep down inside you know I've always had this burning passion for music and the right opportunities hadn't really happened it just you know I was busy shooting movies and doing other things and so yeah, this happened out of, out of the blue, and uh, now I'm here, and I'm excited, and uh, we're rolling with it. Now, did you get the same uh, the same feelings, you know, working on movies, working on, on, you know, modeling as you did with music? No, it's different because I, you know, it's something that I really, really care about. So I think, um, not that I don't care about the other things, but, um, you know... I, I don't know. I'm just so passionate about music mm -hmm. that, um, you know, I'll, I can go shoot a movie and it's fun. And um, and I love doing that as well. Yeah. But deep down inside, this is what I've wanted to get back to. On Tuesday, you're about to release your first single, I Like It Loud. Tell us a little bit about that. Yeah, um, just having the opportunity to work with Bill Hamill was, you know, amazing. And, and you know, I love the track. You know, it's a good dance track. Um, you know, great for the clubs and, and uh, perfect for, you know, what I'm feeling right now, what I'm going through yeah. in my life. And uh, right now I feel like it's just a new time and I'm excited. I'm excited about life. I'm excited to live mm -hmm. and, um, and I'm excited about the music. And, and when you first started, you were actually doing some rapping. We did hear a couple of verses on here, but... Uh, what can we expect with this new music? Will it be mainly, you know, dance music, or can we hear you rapping again? You know, it's a it's a combination. It's dance music, um, a little electronic. Um, um, this track that I'm recording today, um, I'm singing on. Um, but but the first single, I like it loud. You know, it has a little rap in it and uh, and a little singing as well. So, you know, mix it up. And what are the plans for, for this single? Any plans for performances, maybe a tour, music video? Yeah, I'm, I'm heading off to New York um, the second week of December. We're shooting our video there okay. and uh, and doing a bunch of, you know, shows and, you know, looking forward to a tour, looking forward to the whole thing. Nice. And what can you tell us about the music video? Um, well, we just, we just sort of locked down on a treatment. It's going to take place in under, underground club scene in New York City and uh, and uh, a lot of fun things happen. They're also going to follow me around so you know it's almost like you know uh, a life day in the life um, so you get to see many different sides of what I'm doing you know and and then some of the darker sides that are really fun. Nice, <laughs> nice. We'll definitely see more dancing from you coming coming soon as well, oh, right? Absolutely, absolutely. I love to dance. That's my true number one passion. So I, I try to fit it in wherever I can. <laughs> and this is the perfect opportunity. Now, since uh, your music is more is more dancey, um, right now EDM is pretty big. So any plans on maybe considering working with with an EDM artist? Yeah, absolutely. Um, also would be a dream to work with Skrillex. Mm -hmm. That would be a dream. <laughs> that would just... How can, how can we make that happen? I don't know. Let's make it happen. <laughs> Let's do it. Let's uh, do it. Aside from the music, you you uh, guest starred on the 100th show for uh, 90210, which airs this coming Monday. Uh, what can you tell us about that? How was your experience with the uh, 90210 cast? It was amazing. Um, you know... Uh, uh, it's 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 incredible. They have a hundred shows under their belt. Um, I'm honored to be a part of it, and it was cool. We shot the Playboy Mansion, so you know Hugh Hefner was there. All the bunnies were there. Um, I I invited a few friends to come by because I love to see how excited people get. Yeah. You know, 
to see the mansion. It's just pretty cool, you know. Nice. And uh, what what is the show going to be about? What can you tell us about that? Well, my role in 90210 is I, I play the role of Vesta, and she is a burlesque cabaret choreographer. Mm -hmm. So um, basically, we're putting up a show um, for charity, and uh, it was fun. Got a chance to dance a little bit too. Now, as far as the big screen, uh, any other plans that you have coming up? Uh, you know, you've you've been doing a lot of comedy films on there, so any plans for the big screen? Um, I, I just finished shooting an independent film. It's uh, it's called Monica, and it's based on a true story. Okay. And um, it's, you know, it's not a comedy, so it was a little bit more serious. But I had a great time. I had a great time being there. Is it something you have to get used to? Are you used to doing more comedy? I am. I am. I love comedy. Um, I love, you know, when I watch movies, I always want to watch a comedy. I like to laugh and have fun. So, um, yeah, as much as I can, I love to be a part of comedy. <laughs> but it, this was different. It was a challenge. It's more challenging for me. So I like I like to try new things and, you know, just it's go, f good. go for I it. Mean, it's it's been, it. yeah, I mean, it's worked out for you. If you don't try, you'll never know.